This illustration shows 208, 120 volt, three phase, four wire system. Now reviewing the uh, transformer windings uh, at the very top of the illustration, notice that we can measure 120 volts three times to ground. So that means we could pull in a raceway system three ungrounded hot conductors, L1, L2, and L3, and have one neutral pull through there, and the, the L1, L2, and L3 would be sharing that neutral. Now notice we can see that this is permissible when we review the Note 2, review 250.26 item 3, in conjunction also with 250.20B. Now as a reminder, we've calculated now the amps, and notice we take the 208 volt now, times the square root of 3, 1.732 if we took the square root of 3, and we divide that total into the uh, 100,000 uh, VA. Uh, and notice we divide that by 360 volts, which mostly the utilities use. We come up with 278 amps. As a reminder now, if the amps was 277 amps, 0.5, then we could round it up to 278 by 220.5B uh, uh, that we have looked at previously. And it's note one in this illustration. Now, uh, the amps in for this system would be 278. And if uh, the designer or the installer, depending on who had the authority, they could move up from 278 to a 300 amp main, or you could uh, select, uh, say, a con uh, a, an overcurrent device at 250 amp from table 250.40A and completely protect those conductors. Now, if you, for example, if you're a test taker, you have to watch that. Does the question call for protecting the conductor? are using all the ampacity of a conductor. So for example, if a test question said protect the conductor, then you would be using uh, a 250. But if it said size the overcurrent device so all the amps of the conductor could be used, for example, then it would be 300. So kind of uh, keep this in mind. And we have a work called Stalkup's uh, test preparation uh, book. It's a very uh, easy test taker type uh, presentation for test takers. Uh, obtain that and you can see how all this is uh, done on the basics of being very simplified. If you should want a, a book that's a little bit more complicated, then get the Stalkup's work on the journeyman electrician study guide which was very detailed uh, type book that would really, uh, you know, it really increase your knowledge, but sometimes maybe uh, it gives you a little bit more knowledge than you might need if you were just taking a test to be a journeyman. So I would just like to point that out uh, to you. And notice the transformers, 100 kVA, as previously, but notice we're changing voltage so that you know the higher the voltage, then uh, the lower the amps. The lower the voltage, the higher the amps, and we have illustrated this. But what we're showing you in figure 4-4, as well as the previous figures, how the voltage can change the amperage to size the conductors. And our figure 4-4 illustrates 208 volt, 120, three phase, four wire systems, allowing three ungrounded conductors to be used with a neutral or, go, or you could connect three phase, phase to phase, and you'd get 208 volts from L1, L2, and L3.